Hello guys, Tondulu Boys here. This is my first replay YouTube video of playing Poco on GG Network. I'm playing on flip table where all players will be dealt with three cards. At the moment, I had a plus, so my chips will be triple up. So I remove six of spades, hoping that my S and eight of spades will win this knockout run. Haha, <laughs> I won with a set, so I'm going to the next in the money round. <coughs> BB with Q King Sky Call I assume he had a small pair or seated connector Iceman went on in with his, his remaining chips I have to rest with this hand and hope for the best At the moment, I believe Sky looking for a plus or straight because if he had a set, he will instantly call my big bet. Nah, lucky me, Sky was looking for a plus. Anyway, Iceman won the 7k chip with a straight. SB with pair of seven. Again, Iceman again for the second time. Man was lucky again on the river with a set of four. With pair of nines. So I will be against Iceman for the third time. This is the most interesting round I had in this tournament. He had a set. I had a set. But he won on the river again. As man won again with 4 of kind versus my set of 9. Uh, guess how I was to the same player three in a row and this is how i choose my hand to display on youtube with s and nine of spades need to rest here again Iceman for the fourth round obviously he is looking for a flash or a straight or he had a pair X. with SQ
placement went all in I just call fifth times again he he bought had SQ So amazing. Jack five, I fall. But I'm going to show you this round because this is uh, the round which Iceman will go all in again. to play the call and then with 10 and king if Iceman rest I will fall I don't want to double up him with 7 big blinds left I have to go all in with this hand. This is the final table with six players left. So the chip leader called me with anything just to kick me out from this tournament if he win this round. Thankfully, I double up. Yeehaw! Thank you, chip leader. SB with pair of tens. Dora rest to 21k. I just call to see the plot. If there is no big cuts, I will go all in after the flop. That was my plan. No six, no six, no six. Yes, I double up. Huge double up. Thank you, Dora. BB with pay of tens again. And of course, bosses Dora again. I will use the same plan as before. I don't know what happened to Iceman, previously he was moved to another table. I went all in and then Dora <laughs> falls. With this hand 7 3 on BB, I should fall on any race. However, due to large chips in the middle, I should play this round. I have a set already. Hope 
Ping Dora had a AK. So I bet flush on the river to represent kings, but he didn't have any kings. So I want 72,000 chips. Last three players, we made a deal before, so I end up with second place winning money. This round does not have any monetary rewards. So we will just go all in to complete this tournament. Mm. I already lost. And then typically the one with flash on the river. So I started with twenty dollars on GG Poker and now I have over sixty dollars. This is a challenge I created for myself to reach one thousand with tight bankroll management so if you guys like the video please like and subscribe my channel i will post video twice a week or once every three days thank you guys see you again